Rogers program is the best. If he can take an old guy like me and make me win the PGA at 58, I'll tell you what, his program must work. When you get into the program, you'll do it day after day, week after week, and your game and everything else will improve. I feel like uh, in the couple of months that I have been working with Roger, I have seen quite a lot of progress. Certainly that's to the credit of Roger and his program. If you want to improve your game, Roger's your man to help. Hi, I'm Gary Koch. I'd like to ask you a question. Have all the lessons, videos, training aids, and new equipment you've tried made you the player you want to be? Well, if your answer is no, don't feel bad. You're not alone. There are millions of golfers just like you struggling to find the answer. The number one problem for nearly every single recreational golfer is this. They're just not getting any better. And it's probably not your teacher or your equipment that's to blame. Today, we're going to show you how you can finally unlock the key to transforming yourself into the player you've always wanted to be. It's a revolutionary new program that just by using it a few minutes a day, you will increase your range of motion, you will improve your swing, add at least 20 yards to your drives, and even improve the quality of your life. Sound too good to be true? Well, take it from me, it's not. I've played golf all my life, and I've never seen a program like this. If you want to add effortless distance to your drives, improve your flexibility, your golf swing, and your health, guaranteed, then you definitely want to stay tuned. Welcome to the Secrets to Golf Swing Flexibility with Roger Fredericks. Today, we'll show you one of the three moves all great golfers make and why no matter how hard you try, you haven't been able to make them. And we'll introduce you to a revolutionary new program that some of the top players in the world and amateurs just like you are calling the fountain of youth for their golf games. Roger's program is the best. If he can take an old guy like me and make me win the PGA at 58, I'll tell you what, his program must work. If you want to improve your game, Roger's your man to help you. Yeah, my body just couldn't get into those positions without, without the program. Now I can get into those positions that the instructors are talking about. When you get into the program, program, you'll do it in your game and everything else will improve. That's it. That's it. At this point in time that I have been working with Roger, I have seen quite a lot of progress. Certainly that's to the credit of Roger and his program. You get better faster with Roger uh, at a rate that uh, I simply have never seen before with any other program or any other pro. No matter what type of swing, lessons, or method you're using, you can easily add 20 or more yards to your drives and dramatically lower your scores in just minutes a day. We're joined by golf legends Arnold Palmer, John Jacobs, Gary Player, Donna Capone, Tommy Jacobs, and many other professionals and recreational golfers who are rejuvenating their golf games with Roger Frederick's program. And now, here's your host, six-time PGA Tour winner and network golf commentator, Gary Koch. Thanks for joining us. I'd like to introduce you to an innovative golf instructor who's worked with some of the greatest players of all time, including Arnold Palmer, Gary Player, John Jacobs, and Bob Charles. With his unique philosophy, Roger Fredericks has helped thousands of recreational golfers play better and enjoy their golf games and their lives even more. Roger, where are you? Oh, I'm just down here, Gary. I thought I'd get a little stretched out before the show since this was a show on flexibility. Well, Roger, that really is amazing. Have you always been that flexible? Well, quite the contrary. As a matter of fact, up until about the age of 33, 34, I was extremely inflexible, plus I was somewhat crippled. I had had two major knee surgeries, two major wrist surgeries, and my body was an absolute wreck. Well, there's no doubt that uh, you're very flexible now, and your golf swing looks awfully good, too. I took lessons from countless pros. The good news was I learned a lot about the golf swing. The bad news was I got so confused, I didn't know which end of the club to hold. The reality is there's no one right way to swing a golf club. However, there are three things that all good players do, none of which have to do with swing mechanics, and one of those three is by far and away the most important. All right, you got me. What is that? One thing. Okay, it doesn't matter whether it's an upright swing plane, flat swing plane, neutral swing plane, cupped wrist like Freddie Couples, convex wrist like Trevino, flat wrist like Nicholas, flying elbows, tight elbows, neutral elbows, wherever the golfer is on the top of their swing, mm -hmm. once the right hip begins to unwind, all good players come down to impact and they all arrive into what we call a two cheek position. In other words, at ball strike, we should be able to see cheek one and cheek two left shoulder a little bit to the left and the weight off the right side. They are 
all in that position with no exception, all of them. I would say the vast majority of high handicappers that we see look something like this. It's almost like they return to the address position impact with no hip rotation, no weight transfer, and no shoulder rotation. So when they try to get into the two cheek position, they'll end up coming out over the top. There is no doubt in my mind that the average golfer playing today lacks the necessary flexibility to perform a fundamental golf swing. They can't, in other words, get down into the two cheek position, separating their hips from their upper torso. So you believe that this is the reason why handicaps really haven't come down at all in the last 30 years, despite the remarkable advances in equipment and teaching. Gary, no doubt about it. As you know, tour players are incredibly flexible. As a matter of fact, research studies have proven that tour players on average get around 50 to 100 percent more flexibility in their upper torsos mm -hmm. than the average person on the street. I knew that we had more flexibility, but I never imagined the difference between tour players and the average player was so dramatic. Why is that? I think the simple answer to that, Gary, is simply because we all started the game when we were kids. And think about it, we're doing this motion two, three, four, or five hundred times a day, nearly every day of our lives, never stopping to get a real job. <laughs> Thank goodness. <laughs> <laughs> we're going to end up being pretty flexible the rest of our lives in our upper torso. That makes a lot of sense, Roger, but does all of this really affect a golf swing that much? No question about it, Gary. We are designed to have the shoulders over the hips, over the knees, over the feet. From this angle, we want to see the ear over the shoulder, over the hip, over the knee, over the ankle. This is the design of our body. But what happened when the industrial age came of being, our hunting and gathering methods changed radically. And eventually, the average lifestyle turns into something like this. Guy gets up in the morning, goes in and has his breakfast. Gets back up and goes right on back down into his car. Now he spends usually around nine o'clock to five in the office in conferences and telephone calls. And now what happens when we spend a large portion of our lives in this position, you think you're relaxing, but part of your body really isn't. Now your legs aren't getting any stronger, mm -hmm. but the hip flexor muscles are actually keeping you upright. If they weren't being exercised, we would actually keel over and fall out of the chair there. So they're being worked. What happens in our lifestyle now is so many people end up with an imbalance primarily in their hips of their muscles. Um, they end up with weaker legs and tighter hips. When the hips change position, mm -hmm. they'll start to pull in this way. And once they pull in, the forces of our bodies go this way. So we'll see everted feet and we'll see this person walk along. Mm -hmm. Or if the hips get too overworked and they get too old or tired or what have you, they'll start to go under this way and they'll start seeing this person cross the road. That's why the average person, now they get up here, now they try to play golf. And guess what? No leg strength to support, no upper body flexibility, and they go out trying to take some lessons or trying the new state-of-the-art driver, and for most people, they pretty much have a hard time of it. Roger, do most golfers know how to stretch properly? In my opinion, the average person is really stretching very incorrectly. I ask every one of my students if they stretch, mm -hmm. and you know, it's amazing how many tell me that they do. Right. You know, they start showing me some of these, uh -huh. or they put the club behind right, and start doing right. these, or, and I nearly always seem that they're wasting their time and certainly not getting results. Here's the big question, Roger. Will this program really help the average golfer out there? Absolutely. Gary, every single person who has embarked on my flexibility program has radically improved their golf games. I feel considerably different about what exercising I'm doing. Something's happening to me. I wish I had started it about 20 years ago. Unlike most exercise and fitness programs that don't improve your flexibility, Roger Frederick's Secrets to Golf Swing Flexibility is a golf-specific three-part DVD that will improve the range of motion in your body and produce a freer and more powerful golf swing guaranteed. The program begins with a flexibility test to see if you start with the white tee, beginner level, the blue tee, intermediate level, or the championship tee, advanced level. This allows you to customize your program specifically for your needs by basing the instruction on your flexibility level. By using Roger's program for just minutes a day, you'll get more flexible and improve your golf swing faster than any other method you've tried. You'll get stronger, longer, and start swinging your golf clubs with effortless power. I'm now hitting the ball about 20 yards farther with the use of Roger's program. Using Roger Frederick's program, I have increased my drives approximately 40 yards. Using Roger's program, I'm more flexible than I've ever been in my life. I've been to doctors and I've had shots and all that kind of stuff in my back and my hips, my shoulders. At this point in time, I feel like maybe those things are in back of me. I have to credit it to Roger and his program.